You're funny. I'm Draculara, head of the Fear Leader Squad. Headmistress Bloodgood asked me to show you around Monster High. First thing you should do is check your eye coffin for any hex messages from the faculty. Don't worry, Boo. I'm here to help you out. You can grab your new eye coffin from up there. Why is it on top of the climbing wall? Good question. I thought it would be safer up there. Batty idea? More like bad terrific idea, if you ask me. As long as you don't drop it from way up there. <laughs> anyway, you gotta get it before we go inside. There's no way you'll survive your first day of school without it. Mistress Bloodgood trusted me to be your guide. Focus, Draculara. Okay, the first thing I gotta do is show you how to use your eye coffin. more cool stuff. The crew are going to love you. Let's hit up the dorms first, and I'll introduce you to my beasties, Claudine and Frankie. If you get lost, remember to use your eye coffin to check the map.
Hey, Boo Crew! Meet the newest monster in school! Hello! Nice to meet you. I'm Claudine. Voltageous! A new friend! The name's Frankie Stein, but you can call me Frankie. Now that introductions are out of the way, have you all noticed how strange the school is acting? Definitely been shocked at some of the stuff I've seen. Yeah, this is pretty wild, even by Monster High standards. Sounds like a mystery worth looking into. That settles it then. Will you help us figure out what's happening with the school? What's the plan? I want to grab my spell book. I think a little witchcraft could help us along the way. It should be in my witch's lair, but I think I lost the key. It must have slipped out of my pocket when I went to the bathroom. locked my spell book in my witch lair to keep it safe. All right, the book is right there. Grab it and let's go. for grabbing my book. You're the beast. Now, let's use a little witchcraft to see if we can figure out what's going on. That's strange. The spell pulled energy from two major sources of power nearby. It's, it's not me, I swear. Don't be silly, Frankie. We know it's not you. At least not this time. So, are we gonna go check it out? <laughs> As if you had to ask. We're definitely gonna check it out. This spell should help me sense other strange energy around the school. Monster High is so awesome. I had no idea there were places like this hidden around the school. Ooh, look over there. What do you think that is? That must be what my spell was to 
detecting. It looks like an orb of energy. Oh, we should definitely check it out, right? Right, but let's be careful. Wait, the spell I cast earlier seems to be reacting to something. Oh, I hope it's something good.
It's a key. I wonder what use we can make of it in this place. use your dash ability to knock them over. sources of energy I could detect with my spell. Draculara, your witchcraft is out of this underworld. I agree with Frankie, but there's definitely more to it than just those two rooms because the school is still in an uproar. We have a lot to discuss. What do we know so far? 
We found strange sources of energy around the school. Check. Doors that lead to secret rooms? Check. Check. So, um, what does all this mean? Well, we know whatever it is, it's affecting Monster High. Right! Everything moving on its own is seriously frying my brain. Absolute nightmare fuel! Whoa! I just got a hex from Headmistress Bloodgood. Really? What does she want? She wants us to meet her at the front of the school. Well, you know what Draculara is going to say. There's only one way to find out. You got it. Now let's go see what all of this is about. state of my school? Locker doors opening and closing. Desks on the ceiling. Oh, why are they on the ceiling? It's either a really good prank or the school is having a rough time right now. Headmistress Bloodgood, I think everyone's seen the state of the school. Do you have any idea what's going on? Of course I do. I wouldn't be headmistress of this school if I didn't. That is precisely why I asked you to meet me here. I've been watching you all and noticed that once you leave an area, the activity there seems to calm down. Care to explain yourselves? Hmm, I see. Well, that tells me all I need to know. This happens every few generations. The school's energy has become unbalanced. You can think of it like Monster High is feeling a bit under the weather. Now tell me, what do you know about the monstery of this school? Um, that it's the beast school ever? I can tell you've not been paying too much attention in class, but never mind that. A very long time ago, six ancient monster kind tribes came together. Simulacrums, werebeasts, mummies, vampires, sea monsters, and gorgons. Together, they built what you now know as Monster High, a safe haven for all those who would seek to learn and find shelter from the outside world. The reason this particular location was selected is because there is a wealth of natural power here. We use that power to protect us. The power is in a constant state of flux, which means there are times it can become unbalanced. Every few generations, the school chooses several of our students to help balance the sources of energy flowing through it. It seems as though Monster High has chosen you to take on that task. Really? Monster High wants us to help it? Correct. It's no coincidence you found those keys. Monster High must have a lot of faith in your ability to work together. The symbols on the keys are part of a set that represents the ancient tribes. There is an ancient door in the catacombs, which leads to the source of Monster High's power. If that's the case, we have to find all the keys to open the ancient door. That's right. Once you're able to secure all the keys, you'll need to use them to open the door. All of Monster High is counting on us? Talk about no pressure. 
I believe in all of you. Make sure that you look for clues to help guide you. Monster High is full of secrets. We totally got this. I know we can help Monster High if we work together. You may come across other orbs of energy as you venture through the school looking for the keys. Make sure you interact with each of them to create the balance Monster High needs. Canopic jars? Everyone seems to have misplaced something today. Me? Misplaced? I would never. You know I carry them with me everywhere. That's definitely strange. By the way, have you noticed anything else weird happening with the school? Uh, how can you expect me to focus on anything when my organs are missing? Cleo, you've got to chill. Don't worry, we'll help you find the jars. How many jars are missing? There should be four jars. When you find them, bring them straight to me.
Charge back, I can finally focus on other things, like what to wear to class. Now that I have all my now that I have all my charge back, I can finally focus on other things.
can't be right. How in Hades am I supposed to figure this out? Hey, we can help. We're pretty good at solving stuff. Really? You all are out of this underworld. You got that right. Now, what can we do to help? I've been trying to decipher these ancient glyphs. It's way harder than I thought it would be. If I'm understanding this correctly, I think they're clues to a hidden treasure somewhere in the school. Get out. A treasure hidden within the walls of Monster High? Yep. The last place I found a glyph was near the outdoor swimming pool. So your best bet is to start there. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? Break a leg? Or is that bad luck? Better make it both legs for extra good luck.
smell trouble from a mile away. But I think we can handle this. I'll be forever grateful if you can get those books for me. Mummy's Honor! Wow, Mummy's Honor? There's nothing like a bit of fear pressure to get you motivated.
Tower guards the source of Monster High's power. Yep, and we finally have all six keys to open the door. I don't know about you all, but I'm ready to save Monster High. You know, I like the idea of being a legendary school hero. We're ready when you are.
Thank you.